Eastern Roman Emperor Constantine V fought against the Umayyad and Abbasid Caliphates and was the successor to his father, Leo III the Isaurian. He fought against the Arabs and Bulgars and had some successes and failures. What were his military actions in the 740s to the 770s against the Arabs? What was the purpose of transferring Christian populations in Muslim-controlled cities and towns to Thrace? What were the regains from the Abbasid Caliphate and the Eastern Roman Empire? Find out today on Roman History. In June 741 AD, Constantine V ascended to the throne after his father Leo III's death. He continued his father's policy on the Arabs and created the Tagmata, which was Greek for regiments. He used the thematic infantry for mainly defensive and small-scale military actions. After his father's death, Constantine planned to attack the Arab raiders but had to deal with Artavasta's rebellion as a usurper to the throne. Initially, he lost the throne but regained it on November 2, 743 AD. Constantine took an anti-idolatry stance during the iconoclast controversy, the decision over the church to use idols in worshipping God. Pope Zacharias did not support him over his fierce opposition to not using icons in Christian worship. In 746, Constantine campaigned in northern Syria to take advantage of the instability of the Umayyad Caliphate undergoing its third fitna, 744-750 AD, and gained Germanicia and Sozapetra. At the same time, the last Umayyad Caliph, Marwan II, dispatched his navy to take Cyprus but lost at Kyrenia. In the next year, the strategos of the Sybaratians won against the Umayyad fleet from Alexandria. In 748, Gregory the Mamikonid, from Armenia, and Constantine were allies against the Muslims. They got rid of a pro-Umayyad Ashit III the Bagraid. In 750, the Umayyad Caliphate fell, and the Abbasid Caliphate began. In the early 750s, the Abbasids raided Ukeda and left in March 753. Three months later, Abbasid Caliph Abdullah planned an invasion of Roman lands but did not do so because of fighting for his throne. In 751, the Romans recaptured Melitene and Theodosiopolis to have the Christian populations go to Thrace, and they did so for repopulation due to the devastating Bulgar invasions. In 752, the Abbasid navy attacked Sicily. In 755, he won at Kamakan to get the Christians out of there to go to Thrace. Around the same year, the Patriarch of Antioch, Theodore, corresponded with Constantine over the Abbasid situation. And the governor, Salibi, Ali, exiled him to Moab. As a response, he led a 80,000-strong army to Anatolia and got to Cappadocia. He found out about Constantine's retaliation and had to retreat with a few Armenians. In 756, the Abbasids retook Melitene and Theodosiopolis, Venning 209. In 757, the Romans attacked Sicilia to do some raids, gained a truce with the Abbasids, and exchanged prisoners. In 758, the Muslims won a battle on the Melis River in eastern Anatolia against the strategos of Armenia Khan, Paul. Also, he was dead. Constantine was unable to respond due to fighting against the Bulgars. In 760, the Abbasid Caliph al-Mansur agreed to a truce with Constantine. Eight years later, the Abbasids attacked the Armenia Khan theme and besieged Kamacha with its commander, Sergius. In 769, the Abbasid general Ibn Waqas regained Germanicia, but the Romans regained Samasta. In 770, the Abbasids conducted raids, sacked Laodicea Combusta in Anatoly Khan theme, and deported the people. In 771, there were more raids, and Constantine V reacted by attacking Arab-controlled Armenia. Also, historian Timothy Venning wrote, Arab general Al-Fadl reconquers Mopsuestia, Sicilia, from Byzantines. In 772, the Abbasids won the siege of Psyche in the Sibiriate theme. Constantine responded with his army from three military themes, Anatoly Khan, Armenia Khan, and Busalarian, Venning 215. The goal was to stop the Arab retreat. 
however, he failed. Also, he did not get a truce. Three years later, Constantine and Almansur died. The long-term consequence of his negligence in Italy and the outlying islands in the western Mediterranean like Sardinia and the Balearics made them have to defend themselves with their militias. They had to protect against the Arabs, and the loss of the Exarchate of Ravenna by the Lombards due to losing Ravenna in 751 made the situation clear. The two main cities in Anatolia for defense against the Arabs were Amorium and Italia. Constantine's successes demonstrated to his contemporaries the success of his more hostile position of icons. By the end of her regency, the treasury had increased to less than 14 million nomismata. Although the anonymous authors, Genesius, Theophanes Continuatus, and Warren Treadgold stated the statistic, Carlin Hayter did not accept it and saw it as an exaggeration to contrast against the end of Theodora's son Michael III's reign. The success of her foreign policy was the adept financial management under Theoctistus. Thank you for watching, and please like, comment, subscribe, and enable notifications to my channel and videos. Your contribution can really help me. Thank you very much.